Hi, I'm Mila Vasmati and today is uh, the eyes of Paris, Brassaille. It's a um, very important uh, artist that I'm going to explain a photographer. Well, nowadays, until April to April, um, uh, there is an exhibition in the Museum of Picasso in Malaga uh, of uh, about Brassai and Picasso because uh, both of them are friends. Uh, um, well, I'm going to explain. Well, Picasso will be um, portrayed uh, through his life by almost all the great uh, of photography, um, like Man Ray, Halbert List, um, uh, Douglas Durkham, Andre Wiles, uh, Lucy Sinclair, Michel Schirmer, Bill Brown, Robert Capa, the very, very, <laughs> well, Cartier Bresson, uh, Cecil Beaton, oh, the, the, the best, uh, Robert de Sol, Leopoldo Pomez, John von Cuberta, Odora Mer, uh, that was his penna uh, um, for nine years. Uh, but Brassais is the first the, to break the through the the the, how do it, the privacy 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 the privacy sorry the privacy uh, to break the, through the wall of his stu study. Uh, well, he, Brassais is not the real name; is the name of his village. I'm going to explain the biography because it's very, very interesting. In my blog, there are perhaps uh, 15 photos about his um, career. Uh, well, uh, he was born in Brasso, uh, Romania in 1899 and died in voileau sur mer uh, Nisa, uh, France in 1940. 1944, uh, 45 years, this, this. Well, he's a complete artist who make drawing, uh, sculpture, writes, uh, cantos, articles, and publish 20 books. Uh, and his film, <laughs> he make all the things there. Uh, Tant qu'il an hour des vêtres in the uh, Evor, for the most uh, original film in um, 1956 in Cannes Film Festival. <laughs> well, until April uh, 3, uh, 2022, the Picasso Museum in Malaga uh, offers the possibility of a glimpse to this multidisciplinary, multidisciplinary uh, figure. Well, mm, the real names is uh, Obrasai is Yula Halas. He was born in September 9, in 1899, in Brasso of Brasov. It's not sure the name. A town at the beginning in Hungary and after the World War, uh, now in Romania. The first year, year uh, stay of his family in Paris, uh, when he's three, is uh, like an announcement of the what happened in the future. Because in 1924 he moved there. Well, his father was um, take a, a sabbatic year and go to give class at the Sorbonne in Paris. The father is a teacher, a literature teacher. Well, uh, this happens after a study, after when he go there with, uh, in the 1924, uh, it had, this happened after studying uh, painting and sculpture at the university in Budapest after his uh, enlistment in the Calvary Regiment of the Austro-Hungarian Army until the end of the First World War and his stay in Berlin as a journalist and a student at the University <laughs> of Art in the German capital. He acquires uh, French nationality 
uh, by reading Proust uh, and his son French with Henry Miller. Henry Miller tell him that is the eye of Paris. Uh, his friend too of Leo Paul Lafargue and Jacques Prevert and Pablo Picasso too. Well, he adopted the pseudonym of uh, Brasset in honor of his place in origin. He lives in Montparnasse and makes uh, a living as a journalist. Um, he integrate, sorry, <laughs> he integrate um, himself into the artistic and intellectual environment of the Parisian avant-garde, becoming witness of his period. Pablo Picasso is among all these artists uh, and, for, and from their meeting, a uh, great friendship emerged that lasted until the death of the Spanish painter in 1973. Well, the Malaga exhibition uh, of Picasso Museum, uh, the name is, the title is, the, not the title is uh, The Paris of uh, Brasai, photos of the city that I love to Picasso, that love to Picasso. Uh, emphasize of this relationship of the two artists both artists, since both have a mutual admiration. Apart from his personal work, Brasai reproduced Picasso's work in photo, which serve um, to make him known to the world. Brasai is a um, punishment. Well, Brasai captured in this photo, in his photo, the aura of the Paris night with his passer by its illumination. He showed a compassionate uh, attitude toward the prostitute, anonymous clients, uh, drugs, uh, beggars, and homeless people roaming uh, the street. Um, in this time, when he made the photo, is uh, after the 1929, that is a disaster, economic disaster in Europe too. But he's also fascinated by the grand, ordinary and unusual architecture, the small event of uh, daily life and the art of portrait. Uh, they posed from him uh, like Salvador Dali, Alberto Giacometti, Henry Matisse, Jean Miro, Max Cern, uh, Georges Brake, Jean Cocteau, Jean Genet, Henry Michaud, etc. Uh, Brassai and Picasso are made to understand each other and have the gift of curiosity and observation. They are both attracted to collecting small everyday objects like treasure that the mind transform in inspiring treasures. Um, they are both lovers of art brute and both are very fixed on the form and footprint that make up the city. Uh, Brassai uh, spent time immortalizing uh, the graffitis on the wall. It's curious. His primitivism captivated him. No publishers uh, dared to publish this image until uh, the American photographer Edward Steiker expresses his admiration for that work, that kind of work, uh, proposed that uh, he make an exhibition at the MoMA in New York. The book was published in 1961 under the title Graffiti. Proof of the link between Brassai and Picasso for 19 years between 1943 1962, uh, where Brassai acc accompanies a long writing of his uh, with more than 50 snapshots, where he shows his vision of the culture and even of those years in France. Well, that's all. Thanks for all um, for pay attention and until tomorrow. Bye.